Okay, so today we're just fixing some overall <laughs> things that were destroyed um, over the weekend. Like, some t- um, tape falling off, this thing falling, and the track fell off. That's some basic repairs to what we've been seeing earlier. And then we plan to extend the base right here and extend the track so it can keep going. Recording. Okay, so... Today, we had to extend our track that is going to go on top of here. We extended it by making more of these um, straw lengths. Uh, we taped them on like this, using tape on both sides. It's flexible, so we can um, change the straws in any way. Another cool thing is that the straws right here, they have their own flex point, and that also gives the, us the ability to change it to our liking. One of the challenges we faced was that when we would tape it, the straw wouldn't stay curved like up here. It would be flat like right here, and then the marble would just stray right off. So to solve that, we were, we were able to tighten the duct tape on the back here just enough to keep this curved. Um, we also added a few more of these to keep it on track because the marble kept falling off. Grace made these um, straw tracks. I documented. Pierce helped work on the base and repair it. And Owen helped create materials that were being prepared for this. Okay. So I've been working on reinforcements on here. Um, I re- recently reinforced the base of this reinforcement, which was designed for the track. It's to create triangles because triangles are strong. So we're gonna have a triangle going there. Uh, and that'll help transfer some energy from this definitely not too bendy strut to the like main spine here. Um, or this, is, this spine branched off of the spine. And then as for the actual um, tower here, I made heavy reinforcement, tons of duct tape. This is, it feels like solid wood pretty much. Like, you can't really bend it. Um, I'll do to like kinda crush it. Um, yeah, you cannot bend it because I have tons of popsicle sticks, range like this kind of, and they help prevent it from bending. Um, <coughs> so I also taped over everything to make um, it slightly stronger, so like n- nothing gets torn apart as easily. Like. You what probably you, need a say? saw to get through here at, at this point. And then up here, um, I noticed this was like, this has had a pretty heavy lean. So someone put say? this strut like here, What? support this. I might need a little more, but yeah. So that, that's what I've been working on so far. I'll probably keep on working to get some more struts going. Cause no such thing as too much struts, yeah. and there's no such thing as a waste of tape. So, I built this, our loop. So what I did, I just cut a bunch of toilet paper rolls in half, so then I could tape them, um, bend this one in half. So I taped them like this, or yeah, like this, so I could create kind of like a um, roly-poly type thingy. And so I'm gonna add on to this, and we're gonna connect it to our original track that's made out of, um, straws and then yeah